Epilepsy warning, this game contains flashing lights and high contrast imagery. Yeah! What's up, everyone? Rick Explosion, welcome back to Who's Lila? And uh, we kind of know who Lila is, sort of ish, maybe. I mean, there's been hints, but not really sure who. Not really sure who she is. All right, what palette are we going to go with today? I'm not sure. Let's go with uh, Lilac Mania. Yeah, that's the one. What's the. Whoa. Oh, are you shitting me? I can just pick the. The palette? I can literally just make a custom palette. What? Well, that's cool. So last time we got some endings, and uh, we're gonna go for some more endings. So, you know. Alright, so we de we definitely had a new location we didn't check out last time. It was the party. We unlocked it episodes ago. Don't remember which episode, but we unlocked it a while ago. So, we're gonna go ahead and go there next. You know, I have a theory. I have a theory. Is that trash bag that we have to take out each time we start is that trash bag tanya's torso just a theory if y'all have a, a theory about it let me know down in the comments but i feel like that's a theory all right so we're gonna go to the party oh what's this okay let me check out this uh little light bulb here what does that give us november 20 my name is william clark and i was invited to a party by matt hurley it's my first party in the new class smells nice out here but what's over here is that just is that it no there's gotta be something what's this a pumpkin you've unlocked a new palette oh right pumpkin oh look at that new palette all right new palette time let's do it new palette new palette new palette let's put on that new palette yeah right pumpkin wow okay i actually kind of like the colors here it's pretty nice all right let's go over this way i don't know where we are at i thought this was supposed to be a party this is clearly not a party. All right, who's over there? I want to talk to those. Who are these people? A couple enjoying an evening smoke. Well, at least one of them's enjoying it. So, are you happy you got out finally? Oh, this is Jay and Mandy. Okay, yeah, they get creeped out by me. Haha, <laughs> yeah. Thanks for pulling me out, I guess. It's scary to think how it would feel to be home right now. Hey, man. You wanted something? Um, no. With a smile. That's a bit awkward. Uh, sorry. Could I have a cigarette? Um, sure, man. Help yourself. You got a cigarette. Nice. Yes. Picking up bad smoking habits. All right, that's... I don't know who this is. I'm gonna go talk to this guy. Hello, sir. That's Matt Hurley, the host of the party. Oh, hey, Matt. Hey, dude. William, right? Oh, hi, Matt. Um, sorry, I'm late. Hey, don't worry, man. The night's just starting. Come in. Want some beer? Um, sorry, I'll pass. Thanks for inviting me, though. No prob. You're a newbie, but you seem cool. Matt and the guys here are so awesome. I wish I wasn't that shy and could actually tell them that. All right, so let's go inside. Let's go to the party. Let's enjoy ourselves. Let's fucking party, bro. I want a drink. Whoa. Okay, it is lit in here. Whoa. All right, let's go talk to some people. They're having fun, I think. Cool. I love this song. I wrote it, you know. You like it, right? Uh, sure. What's over here? It's just the stereo, right? Whoa. I did not mean to change the song. La booze. I don't feel like getting drunk today. Why not? They're at a party. Okay, I did not mean to... I did not mean to do that. Let's go talk to those people up there. They seem cool. You guys want a cigarette? I found it. Let's see. The song changed. Finally! Oh my god! Thanks, man! Yeah, dude, I'm freaking... I'm freaking loving this party up. Stranger. Wait. Oh, is that Evil Will? That's fucking weird. Okay, Evil Will's here. That's... Pretty creepy. You can hear creaking and some muffled noises coming from this bedroom. <laughs> I have a strong feeling that its co occupants do not crave company right now. Yeah, I'm, I'm assuming that creaking is, um... I think they're just wrestling in bed or something. Ah, I'm sure they're just having their own fun. What's going on here? Hello? A girl lying on the bed. She has to be really drunk. Oh my god. A girl? You made a surprised face. Oh, it's Martha. Oh, uh, I'm fine. Uh, just had a bit too much to drink. Do you need anything? Water? 
No, I... I'll just slide down a little. Should I leave you alone? No, wait. What's your name? I'm Will. I think we met at school, remember? Oh, haha. <laughs> you are... You're the new guy, right? Too bad you have to see me this way. I, uh... I don't usually drink, you know. Jeez, figures. I must look really pathetic to you now. Hey, come on now. Everybody's like that sometimes. Any reason you drank so much tonight? It's... Uh... A freaking guy, you know, the one who's... She tells you a very confusing yet relatable story. In conclusion, the guy she's talking about sucks ass. Let's give a disgusted look. This guy sucks ass. Err. You feel oddly moved by this half discernible story. Maybe it's because you've been in the same situation. Or maybe you're just a bit high from so much social interaction in one evening. Y yeah, you get me, Will. I wish he would too. Hey, you wanna... She makes sounds that usually precede vomiting. You took the poor girl to the bathroom. <laughs> what did she want to do? <laughs> did she want to like... Okay, I mean, I, I guess she wanted to like make out or something. I don't know. You probably need to tell Matt. Hi there. You feel dizzy. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. What are you doing? Hey. Yeah, let's, let's make that, let's make that smile. Yes, that one in particular. Hey. You smiled. This looked awkward. I don't think we've met before, right? You're... Hey, have you seen Martha? Hold on, Ellie. He probably doesn't know who that is. You're the new guy, right? I'm gonna smile again. Seems right. Why is it neutral? There we go. Yep, that's a smile. Uh -huh. No, hey, lip up. There you go. Yep. Err, uh, that's my smile. Another great face right there, Will. Anyway, I'll go look for Martha. I'm Ellie, by the way. I'm Will. She left. And there she goes. Oh, right. My name's Tanya. Tanya Kennedy. She joking- She jockingly stretches her hand forward, and you give her a handshake. Is Martha the blonde girl? She's... kind of plump, too. Heh. That's probably her. What, have you seen her? She didn't feel too well, so I helped her to the bathroom. That's probably Danny's fault. That asshole. Yeah. I think I'll go help her out. Wanna come with? Sh sure. She left. Uh, I'm gonna talk to Matt first. I feel like I need to talk to Matt. Where's Matt? Matt? Oh, Matt. There you are. Yo, Matt, you got a girl puking in the bathroom. Hey, Matt. I just took a girl to the bathroom. What, did Martha get drunk because of that asshole? Dude, I guess Danny's just the notorious asshole. Because of Danny, yeah. Ellie and Tanya went to help her out now. Oh, good. Then they won't need my help, I guess. <laughs> Thanks for letting me know. Yeah, you're welcome. Wait, up this way. This way, this way, to the house, back to the party. We're going back to the party. Let's go talk to some people. I'll talk to all the people. Hello. Hey, are they still going? Who? The guy's in that one bedroom, man. I guess so. Ugh, teenagers these days, am I right? Are you, are you not teenagers? Well, at least someone got lucky tonight. Sorry, I need to talk to Matt right now. Heh, see ya. You're a good listener, you know that? I already talked to Matt. The fuck? I'm gonna go back here. Okay, they're still probably fucking in there. I'm gonna go in this room. Oh, okay. There you go. Better now? Y yeah. Thanks, you guys. And what we talked about earlier. Look, Danny's my friend. But I'm not gonna lie. He can be kind of an asshole sometimes. Yeah, Danny's an asshole. Don't even think of blaming yourself, alright? It's not because there's something wrong with you. Danny's just been through a pretty fucked up relationship himself. That doesn't excuse him, does it though? Hmm, I'm just telling you why he did it, alright? I think I already said that he acted like an asshole. Oh, hey Will. Guys, that's my new friend Will. I wanna- I wanna smile. Don't- no disgust. No- whoa, what are you- Smile. Smile- yep, there's your derpy smile. The der. Hey guys. This sounded natural. Sup, man? We haven't met before, have we? Yeah, I, I haven't been to school much since the start of the year. Oh, gotcha. 
Well, nice to meet you, Will. Thanks for taking care of Martha just now. Yeah, thanks, Will. I really needed that. Wait, so these people are actually my friends. What the fuck? They seem to have been talking about something else before you came. There's an awkward silence. Well, if everything's fine with Martha, I'll go get some air. Hey, what? We just came here, come on. I'll see you all later. Tanya? Are you ignoring me? Come on, we barely hang out anymore. It's... Graves. Oh. Well, okay. Jeez. I don't get what's wrong with her. Mike... What? What are you looking at me like that for? You feel it's time for you to leave. I will leave. Oh, there's Tanya. Hey, Tanya. She's looking at a painting on the wall. There's a sun-drenched cafe with huge, seemingly glassless windows. Hey, Tanya, what a... Oh. Sorry, am I interrupting something? Michael, please. What? What is up with you today? I don't think I've done anything to deserve that, have I? I see how it is. So you'd rather hang out with some weird dude just you just met, huh? Bruh, we just met, and you're already calling me weird. That's kind of fucked up. Instead of at least talking to your boyfriend. I'm just worried about about you. Alright, why did it say about about? I'm just worried about about you, alright? Ugh. He leaves. Don't be mad at him. He actually cares about me, you know? That's the worst part. I'm not mad. I get it, I guess. Tanya seems very tired. That's a nice picture there, isn't it? It's Hopper, right? The cafe or something. Do you like it? Yeah. It has a certain feeling to it. Like incredible loneliness, but cozy at the same time. Almost like you've been there before. Yes, yes! That's what I was getting. Listen, um, Will. I think I'll go downstairs and get myself a drink now. Then how about we go for a walk? I really need to cool down right now. Sounds good to me. Okay, I guess we'll just go downstairs then. I'm just gonna follow Tanya. Oh, okay, we're going for a walk now. All right, cool. I think Will's gonna get lucky. <laughs> I think I drank a bit more than usual there. Finally, some fresh air. This party was getting a bit intense, wasn't it? Yeah. To be honest, I'd never expect you to be here. Oh yeah, why not? Because I look like a tight-ass, straight-A student? Yeah, kinda. <laughs> well, there's a lot about me that people don't see. Ooh, mysterious. <laughs> what about you? You don't seem to be very talkative when you come to the school. You don't come often. Oh god, the derpy face. I... don't believe in education. Huh? Really? No, I mean... I just have to tackle a lot of shit on my own. Like, you know, I live alone. So I gotta do stuff like working, doing chores, all that. Sounds tough. Where are your parents? Dad ran away when I was little. Mom died three years ago. I'm... I'm sorry to hear that. It's okay. No use getting all emotional about it now. I had a pretty nice childhood. Just me and her, you know? I think I'm finally getting something good in my life. But yeah, it gets tough sometimes. Sorry I started talking about all this. It's okay. What about you? You mean, my upbringing? Well, nothing special, I guess. I've had a nice childhood, two sisters, private school, and so on. <laughs> Were you a talented kid even back then? Yeah, <laughs> it's funny. My parents used to call me a prodigy. It kinda sucked, though. How's that? It's hard to explain. Everyone around seems to expect great things from you. Like, all of the time. And when you fail, it's like the end of the world, because it's as if you betrayed their faith in you. I know it sounds dumb, but it feels terrible, honestly. This makes a lot of sense. I don't know. I still kind of feel like a failure. Why? You're literally one of the best students at school. I don't know. It's like, even when I do something right, win an award or something, I just get anxious that the next thing will fail. And this never seems to end. Phew. Sorry for all that. Honestly, I'd kill for a cig right now. Heh. <laughs> Smoker, huh? Uh-huh. 
Makes dealing with stress easier. Well, I was quitting anyway. Mike hates smokers. Well, that's kind of man manipulative, no? Her expression suddenly turns bitter. Don't think I'm not noticing what you're trying to do. Mike's an awesome guy, and I love him, alright? You have no right to stick your nose into other people's lives. You don't know anything, alright? And, you know, I didn't say anything. All I did was just make an expression. How about you fix your own shit first? Like your... St your stupid face expressions and how you act like a complete dunce when there's people around. Okay? Fuck. I'm sorry. No. I'm sorry. Yeah, I think you should be sorry. What the fuck? I'm a monster, aren't I, Will? Come on, tell me. You think I'm, I'm a disgusting human being? I don't think you're disgusting. I just think you're a monster. I just don't understand you. Makes sense. I can't understand myself either sometimes. I... It's hard. Yeah. Well, your friends are there to help you. Well, they don't really know me. Even Martha doesn't. What about Mike? She laughs. Are you joking, Will? Jeez. Of course not. Well, I'm gonna smile here and say, I think I'd like to know you. She laughs again. Trust me, you don't. You really don't. I don't deserve all that anyway. You're just wasting your time trying to be my friend, Will. I really don't deserve all that. My friends are too sweet. I thought Graves is perfect for someone like me. It's a shame he turned out to be such a wonderful guy. Can I say something? I hope you won't be offended, but really, the world is not a revolving around you, Tanya. The way you beat yourself up is not going to help anybody. I... Your friends may not be able to understand what you feel. I know I don't understand. But we are all ready to be by your side no matter what's happening behind the mask you seem to wear. Her voice cracked. I... We're back, Will. She sits on a bench. Something feels different about her. Now that you've talked. It's a nice feeling. Well, I guess just keep talking to her. Still want to smoke? Here. <laughs> I found a cigarette. Someone gave it to me. Thanks. <laughs> Mike would be pissed if he saw me now. If he saw us. Yeah. You know, it may sound strange, but I feel like I've seen you too. Like, like in a dream or something. Have you ever been to the Sunshine Cafe, Will? Is that the one down the avenue? Yeah, it's a cozy place. Huge windows and a lot of sun. Just like that picture we saw. For a moment, there's a funny feeling inside you. No. No. I've never been there. Oh well. Something's not right. You both stay silent for a moment. There's slow dance music playing inside. Wanna dance? Oh, okay. Okay, we dancing. Okay, Will. I see you. Oh, sh wait. Oh, is he going for something? Ooh. All right, Will. Will's got moves. Will's got the moves. Will's got moves, man. Holy crap. Are they gonna kiss? Are they gonna kiss? No, they're just dancing. They're just dancing. There's Will. Our boy Will. Oh, they're getting awfully close. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh man. What is happening? Everyone's dancing. Will's staring into nothingness. More people are dancing. I don't know who that is. There seems to be a lot going on in this scene, but it's just it's just dancing. It's just a lot of pixelated dancing. Now what? Oh god, there's two Williams. What where am I? Who are you? Oh god, it's Dark William. I can't seem to do anything. N no, I... It couldn't have been her. I've... I've never even... You've never even what? Dude! I think we kissed Tanya. <laughs> I 
<laughs> I mean, I think we did more with Tanya than just Kiss, but you know. Okay, we got an ending. We got one ending. What was it? It was the moon. We got the moon. All right, nice. You know what? Screw it. I think we can go for another ending, honestly. Okay, so for this next ending, I had to look this one up, but apparently if you type in a... S okay. If you type in a specific address... Oh, I want to change the palette real quick. If you, ch if you specifically type in a specific address, it'll take you to the Sunshine Cafe, which they mentioned in-game. We didn't have the address, but apparently if you, if you look it up in Tanya's Twitter account, her actual Twitter account, you'll actually find it, which is pretty crazy. All right, we just dumped the trash. All right, going to the bus stop. Here we go. Our slow ass footsteps walking over there. Ugh. So I guess if you type in, I think it's 200 Grand Beaver Avenue, unknown location. Hmm, is that not it? Oh, okay, that worked. Okay, I, I, I guess it's cap sensitive. <laughs> But here we are. The Sunshine Cafe, or whatever it's called. All right, what's over here? Let's see, a cup of freshly made coffee. You wonder who's it, who it's for. You've unlocked a new palette. Oh, we got a new palette. Okay, I'll just put that on then. Sick. What's over there? What's this? Are we waiting for someone? Oh, hi there, ma'am. Coffee as usual, Lila? She doesn't wait for you to answer. Thanks. Detective Yu's been here earlier today. Huh. Really? Yep. He didn't ask anything about you, though. Hmm. Makes sense. Doesn't even need to, that sneaky jerk. Huh. <laughs> yeah. Is he still figuring out, you know, who you are? Well, obviously. You wouldn't be here if he wasn't, would we? Well, yeah. Have you thought that maybe he's just giving us some more time out of pity? I mean, it could be that he already knows that you're, uh... Shh. Shut up. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just teasing. Oh, come on. You know you's listening even now. Sure, otherwise I wouldn't be here talking to you. What is happening right now? What the f- Who is Detective You? Like, who is he really? I feel like he's like... Just like this like background character who kind of just knows what's happening, like what's actually happening. We haven't met him yet, we've, we've only heard about him. You must think he's really powerful, mustn't he? That's what I'm saying! Guess so, he's certainly good at figuring things out. A nosy guy, I give him that. Well, at the end of the day, his curiosity is what keeps us alive. That, and his pain. Yeah, poor guy actually. To think, how much of the time he gives us is filled with suffering. What's he doing it for, then? He hopes for that slither of satisfaction. Our world is built so. It gives him little pieces of info, so he feels as though he's getting somewhere. Doesn't he realize that 90% of his time consists of pain? And only, like, 10% is goodness? I don't know. Even so, he's a machine of pain. A suffering generator, as all humans are. At least his attention is what keeps... Well, come on, don't give out too much. I know we haven't talked in a long time, but... He's listening. <laughs> yes. He'll pester me about this for sure when I come back. Do you have to? It's up to him. It's up to you to decide. Are we Detective You? Are we Detective You? It's up to you to decide. We haven't met Detective You because I think we we are Detective You. We're the detectives in this game. Oh my god, I'm about to flip the fuck out. Well, thanks for coming. Dude, my whole theory was that we were Lila, but it turns out we're not Lila. We're Detective You. Or at least that might be my new theory. I don't know. This is, this is insane. Well, thanks for coming today. I rarely see you these days. Yeah, I kind of missed all this. Okay, well, I guess we get out of here. That's it. Oh, we got a new ending. The sun. Oh my god. Are you fucking kidding me? The sun and the moon. Wow. Nice. We still have more room for endings, so I'm guessing there's still maybe a few more. There, dude, there's only a f there's only room for like a couple more, so... I think we're almost done with this game. 
All right, and I think that's gonna be it for today. Thank you guys so much for checking out my video. We are almost done with this game. I'm not sure how many more parts this will be, but we're getting pretty close to finishing it. <sighs> All right, thank you guys so much for watching the series. I'll see you guys next time in the next one. Peace.